Okay, reattached everything, plugged it back in, and ran the heat for a while, just so that we could get a bit more pressure out of it. We're now let it seem to cool and start to pull coffee up. It's looking kind of light. Maybe I didn't put in enough ground. Or too much water. I think I did 600 mils. Uh, it looks like we might not have a full seal. I'm getting some bubbles in the line. It's struggling. Actually, I think it might be hitting the bottom of the flask and then heating back up again. Because it hits the bottom, the bubbles are racing back up, and then they're coming down. Okay, now... We're starting to see. Yep, the glass is too hot. Something to keep in mind. It's also still looking pretty light. So yes. Probably too coffee. much water. I don't know if it shows, but you, they're bubbling, racing up this tube. And this dropping and rising perceptibly. The flask is going to burn the coffee. I don't know how to get around that. It's even with the pop. Whoa! It's now trying to suck air through, and in, even with the top popped off, there's so much vacuum pressure that it's run out of liquid in the beaker. There is no coffee left there. It is now boiling, trying to get more air in through. That's impressive. I never would have expected that. Not dark, but it is a coffee-like liquid. All right. Taste test time. <laughs>